It's Wine Wednesday and boy is it hot outside. I'm joined in studio by our wine expert, Kathy Marston, and she's going to introduce us to the wild child and tell you why this is the perfect summer wine. Hello. Hi, how are you doing? I like the name of this wine. I knew you would. <laughs> as soon as I saw that, I thought I'm not too because Jen's going to love that wine. <laughs> Um, even before I tasted it, and I think when you taste it, you're going to love it as well. Mm. So, um, yeah, this is very cool. It's from the Tudor, it's a new release. Um, and they've always done amazing Sauvignon Blancs, absolutely fantastic. They're in Durbanville, and it's cool climate, and it's all meant to be, you know, great conditions for Sauvignon. Um, and what they've done here is they've actually put this in some oak, so, mm. um, which is great. They haven't called it a Blanc Fumé or anything, but if you read the spec sheet, then you'll see that they have used um, a nice amount of oak on that. Um, and the thing I like about this is that it's really balanced. If you're going to use oak on a wine, particularly on a Sauvignon, yeah. you don't want to overwhelm it. You want to make sure that you still get all that nice, crisp, clean kinds of flavours. Mm. Um, so, but just a little bit just makes it a really, really nice, satisfying wine. So uh, I thought you'd enjoy this. Well, let's See, give it a bash. Are feeling wild? Yeah. I'm feeling wild. Awesome. Let's, let's do, do this. this. Okay, let's have a try. Oh, it smells lovely. Mm, all those nice green absolutely yeah. scents coming through do you and call the them a flowers. scent well you call them aromas but aroma the green aroma you know that is yeah <laughs> and there's all the perfume in there as well oh very lovely mm. and that is very well balanced like you were Isn't saying it? yeah it's not overpowering I think someone who's known into very heavily oaked wines would still enjoy this. I think they would, because actually I think they'd probably struggle to pick up the fact that it mm. is oaked. Yeah. Um, I think all they would think is that there's a little bit of spice in there, you know, so that's a whole wild thing mm. and spicy um, thing going on there. And, and just a little bit of sort of weight in the middle of the palate, which I think does a, you know, a great service. I think that's a really nice wine. Now tell me about the flavors that we're experiencing in this one. Well, I get quite a lot of tropical notes on this mm. one. I get quite a lot of guavas in there and some granadillas in there as well. Um, and then there's a little bit of, sort of vanilla and cream coming through. The vanilla is actually um, very, very nice. I think it's, it's like a sort of, what's that lovely bowl that you have your bowl of poached guavas and custard. I think that's a very sort of typical South African dessert. So um, I've never had that. No, I've had it several times. It's actually delicious. I'm Sounds not sure it would delicious. go with this wine, I have to say. I think the wine's a little bit too dry to go with, yeah. with guavas and custard. <laughs> but there's that kind of sort of feeling mm. going on in there. Now, we've actually paired this with not guavas and custard. Yes. We've chosen festive prawns on the braai. Now, mm. I think this wine is perfect for entertaining, perfect for a party. Yeah. Prawns are always a crowd pleaser. Mm. So, so we know why we've done that um, from an aesthetic point of view. but. When it comes to flavors, why have we put these together? Well, I think that you've got this great acidity, and that really sort of appeals with seafood anyway. But these prawns come with a little bit of chorizo, so there's a little bit of a spicy sort of wild thing going on in there as well. And seafood and chorizo is a great match. And I think that this wine, although it is dry, normally if you're going to have like sort of quite spicy foods, you need something a little bit sweeter. I think that that little bit of vanilla is just going to offset that chorizo really nicely. Um, and I would very, very happily quaff down a bucket load of this with some <laughs> this, this summer. So um, I, I can absolutely see myself sitting outside on a braai enjoying this with some, some of those lovely juicy seafood prawns. It'd be great. All right, so I guess I'm coming over to yours. You can with pleasure, <laughs> absolutely. Well, cheers to the wild child. Yes, absolutely. Okay.